So the sun is to the west, sorry, to the east. So that's not a lot of help. Hi, and welcome to another daily challenge video. Yesterday, I had a near perfect score in South Korea and then uh, three rounds in Germany, Pakistan, and Norway, where I was quite far away. And then uh, one round in Bolivia, where I was very far away. Uh, I even guessed the wrong country, I guessed Brazil. And I ended up with another silver score of 18,600 points. So I am playing with no move panel soon. Uh, let's see if I can do better today. Let's go. Okay, so uh, this is either going to be the US or Canada. Or well, also the um, um, camera is a bit wonky. I'm not sure if that's a clue. But I'm looking at this sign here. You can't see it properly, but it could be a Canadian sign. Uh, I think it's a yellow and black checkerboard sign. Uh, I think it indicates that uh, cars come from both directions when you drive onto this road. Uh, even if it was a US, I would guess in a fairly similar area to where I'm guessing now, so I'm going to guess we are somewhere in this area, in the, I think this is the part of the Great Plains area, so let's go close to Saskatoon and hope I'm right. Okay, that's a very good start. Okay, uh, let's see where we are. Are we in the Northern or Southern Hemisphere? So, um, these lines here, are they sunshine and the lines here are shadows? I think so, possibly. That would at least indicate that the sun is to the south. Also, it's a car ahead driving on the left. No, it can't be, uh, because if it was driving on the left, uh, I think the only place we could be is uh, Malta, but I don't think it is. It could be Malta, although a lot of breeze for Malta, at least for me. I would mean, I, I guess this is, I mean, apart from looking at that car, I'm guess, I would guess Greece, maybe. I mean, it could, could still be Malta, but I'm not entirely sure. It does look like that car is driving on the left, to be, to be fair. That is a car at all. I think it's a car, but I'm not entirely sure. I'm gonna hang on. Uh, let's just. Thought I saw something in the background. Uh, no. I'm gonna go Greece. Uh, that could be a mistake, but no, I shouldn't go in Greece. Someone like here. Oh, it was Italy. Uh, okay, I uh, did not expect it to be Italy. Uh, I think I'm, I'm slightly closer than I would have been if I guessed Malta, so yeah, um, an okay guess. That car there is definitely driving my left.
I'll tell at all if we are in a southern or northern hemisphere. I'm presuming we are in a southern hemisphere. really see anything else um these poles have some sort of pink sleeves on them and i can't say that i've seen that before But for me, it's between the three places, either Australia, Malaysia, or, or Singapore, no, sorry, Malaysia, or Indonesia. I'm not entirely sure. I'm going to go Indonesia, but I don't really know. Okay, I didn't even consider Bangladesh. Um, so, uh, yeah, way off. <laughs> uh, let's see. So the sun is to the west, sorry, to the east, so that's not a lot of help. I have a feeling this could be South America. In a way, this is quite similar to the round we had in Bolivia yesterday. But I, I, I don't know if it, if it is Bolivia. The soil, it's not really a reddish soil, maybe a tiny bit, so it could be Brazil. I, I'm going to go Brazil again like I did yesterday. And I was way off, it was in Mexico. Finally, um, so I won't be able to get a, uh, a silver score today, so bronze score is all I'm going to get. Um, let's see where this could be. Again, the sun is to the east. Maybe northeast. Based on the um, word there, I think we are we are not in Brazil. We are in uh, a uh, in a Spanish speaking country. Although, having said that. Does that have a C with a thing underneath it, whatever that's called? Which you usually don't see in uh, Spanish. There are some Spanish words that have it, but it's more common in Portuguese.
Hmm. I mean, if it hadn't been for that one letter there, I probably would have gone Ecuador. But, like the last one, I'm going to go Brazil. And hope for the best. Okay, uh, this one was Brazil. Uh, but I was quite far away. So, all in all, one good round. Um, and the rest, too far away. And three rounds in the wrong country. Uh, so, so uh, that's not great at all. Um... Anyway, as always, if you like these videos and would like to see some more, uh, please consider subscribing to the channel, also hitting the like button and leave me a comment. And I shall see you again tomorrow for another daily challenge. Bye for now.